The Audios Aeronautical Development Agency is seeking technology come investment partners for speedy development and execution of the AMCA twin engine medium weight stealth fighter jet program and to keep the program running smoothly the Aeronautical Development Agency has opened doors for Indian private sector companies to join the development and manufacturing of the AMCA the critical design review has been completed, and the agency is awaiting approval for additional funds from the Cabinet Committee on Security to manufacture AMCA prototypes. After the approval, it will take at least four years to manufacture the first aircraft under the program, and the Aeronautical Development Agency has prepared a 10-year roadmap for making the first five prototypes and flight testing. Hindustan Aeronautics will showcase a scale model of its brand new Hindustan lead and fighter trainer for the first time at the Aero India 2023, which is a next generation supersonic trainer that will play an important role in modern combat aircraft training. It will feature an Acer radar, electronic warfare suite and infrared search and track system, and will provide training to young fighter pilots in sensors weapons missions and roles executed by modern air powers, and this new supersonic trainer will have immense export potential. An FOC standard Tejas Mark I aircraft showcased at Aero India 2023 for the static display was seen integrated with the indigenous 110 km range Astra Mark I missile. Astra Mark I has completed flutter and captive flight trials from Tejas Mark I, and it will soon start developmental trials. The Astra Mark I will be standard BVL missile on the upgraded Tejas Mark I-A, that will start delivery to the Indian Air Force in February 2024. The DRDO has tied up with Indian firms Larsen and Tubro and Thermax Limited to manufacture the indigenous air independent propulsion system. The first Scorpion class submarine INS Calvary is scheduled to come in for refit in mid 2024, during which the hull of the submarine will be cut for adding the AIP section, and it will be tested at multiple levels to ensure foolproof integration. France's Naval Group will certify the AIP design, and Naval Group will be the lead agency for integrating the AIP with the six Calvary class submarines. India's Defence Acquisition Council has approved the procurement of the 155mm 52 caliber mounted gun system for the Indian Army, that will be done under the Buy Indian category. The document reveals that the mounted gun system should have a maximum weight of 30 tons, and the maximum firing range of the system should be more than 38 kilometers, and it must fire all in-service 155 mm ammunition. The RDO developed at AGS based mounted gun system is all set to start user-assisted firing trials, and it is seen as the prime contender in the 814 mounted gun system program. Swedish firm Saab Group has said, that after dropping Adani defense, Saab is now considering a tie-up with a local Indian partner to cement its commercial bid in the 114 MRFA program. Saab is considering to have a fully owned subsidiary for the manufacturing of Krypon in the country if allowed by the Indian Ministry of Defense, but it is also open to having local collaboration with Indian aerospace manufacturers. Saab will display the Gripony at Aero India 2023, which was not a full matured product in the previous MMRCA program. Under a contract signed in January 2022, Hindustan Aeronautics has successfully handed over an advanced light helicopter Mark III to the government of Mauritius ahead of schedule, that will be operated by Mauritius Police Force. Mauritius already operates advanced light helicopters and Dornier 228 aircraft built by Hindustan Aeronautics. Suryadip 2 Projects Private Limited has launched the first ammunition cum torpedo cum missile barge, that are meant for transportation and loading and unloading of ammunition torpedo and missile on Indian Navy warships. 
the company is building 11 such barges for the Indian Navy, and all auxiliary equipment and systems have been sourced from indigenous manufacturers. Thank <laughs> you.